Bonjour everybody, je m'appelle Spamos and welcome back to Passepartout, the starving artist. Now, Passepartout speaks to himself and he says, Oui, now I have a big studio and I must appease la high society. Passepartout needs to clean up his act. So he had a haircut. Oui, okay, now, what anyone's doing? Let's begin! Act 2, pursuing the craft. We are back, we have our aficionado studio now. In the last episode, our good friend George, he come back, he buys some more artworks, but the man in the sky tells me I must appease. The high society, the snobs, Pwah. if I am to get anywhere. So today we shall push aside Josh and try to appease the big ones. And Pwah. the voice of inspiration speaks to me in the form of the guy who sells eggs. And he says to me, Pwah, why don't you draw La Botanic giving her all to get to Key Island before she sinks? And Pat Patul, he thinks to himself, this is not a bad idea, but I take it one further. What if we bring an air of fantasy into this and we draw the Botanic? As if she did ground herself on the beaches of Kia. This would be an amazing sight for all of it to be seen, am I right? Okay, so let's begin. As always, we start with the foundation. Ba, 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 ba. Okay, as always, we start with the layering up. So we have our sky. Now we bring in the water. Eh. <laughs> That's amazing. So we're gonna have, I don't know, let's go for the paintbrush. Let me just sploosh this on. Sploosh. Oh, the sploosh did not work. Sploosh? Sploosh! I want this beach to feel rural, you know? So I'm gonna just, you know, spray on a little bit of, of grass, a little bit of kind of beach, beachness. <laughs> it is not a pristine uh, sandy beach. No, no, no. This is a, a dirty beach, a dirty, dirty beach. Everybody likes a dirty beach, am I not wrong then? No! Oh, bills are inbound! Tax man, you caught me at an inopportune moment! Your prices are not fair! I'm an aspiring artist! And you treat me like your common snobby folk! No, 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 no! Okay, we have our dirty shrubbery beach line! Okay, I know where I'm going with this, bear with me, okay. Now, I want to make the ocean less uniform. Using this amazing new utensil, we can create really quite scene-specific splooshes and swooshes. Are we? Are we? Okay, so we have our beach, we have our water, we have our skies. It's time to insert our Leviathan as she glides up onto the beach. <laughs> Again, you must be careful grinding on the beach. <laughs> Breaking news, the Eiffel Tower is a secret mind control device according to conspiracy theorists. You cannot trust them. They believe that the Titanic and the Olympic they switched. They believe that uh, Hitler himself sailed in a U-boat for the Nazi ghost to the North Pole and entered into the inner earth. And he's hanging with the, the, the lizard people. This is a terrible suggestion. But NASA knows about this. So for Google Earth, they have manipulated clouds to cover their secret entrance. That's a true theory. It is time for a difficult bit. It is time to frame in the sheep. A swoosh. And that needs to come at kind of an angle. A bit like this. Are we? Are we? And now we connect the two together. Now see the ship, it is not completely straight. It is not a straight line from bow to stern. No, no. There is a shear. And what this means is that it will well, it will swoosh. It will bow and arc between the bow and the stern. We! Oui! I love this new pencil. It is astonishing. Okay. Oh, wee, wee, wee. This is really starting to come together. I am feeling very confident about this piece. And again, we're trying to keep a perspective. Quick news, crime rates rise as pa pastry prices skyrocket? Oh, shut up, breaking news. It may seem like sometimes some things forward in the picture are a bit oversized, and you do not quite see how the distance works. But hopefully, it will reveal itself before all is said and done. I think the bridge is uh, not quite wide enough, uh, the wheelhouse, but uh, no, we, 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 we. Now, Passport to attempt to draw left funnels. Now, the funnels have been hit and missed of power in the series. Sometimes they are skinny, sometimes they are quite chubby, sometimes they are a bit wobbly. So, your Passport 2 will make a concerted effort to make the Britannic as good as can be. That looks good! The Britannic is coming to life before ourselves. 
Bon! Okay, so I mean, uh, the second funnel, the, the top is a bit odd, but do not worry, because while well, we live uh, with the Britannic, there is no black tops. It is all, well, it's not even buff. It is more like a, a gold. Bills, okay, the bills are coming thick and fast. So here is a fun fact that uh, you may appear from photographic uh, images that uh, the hull of the Britannic is white, but you would be minusculely wrong, for it is actually a very light shade of gray. Now you see, Passport he attempts to try to create some texture by using the grays and the whites to try to show some differentiation between distance, so it's not such a flat image. Oh, we, oui. oh, we, oui, we, oui, we, oui, we, oui, we. Oui. Let's get some of her anti fouling. She is beached, she is in shallow water, so her bow is being pushed upwards. Like this. We, oui. okay, and then the ocean will once again close that back up again. Ah, oh, awesome, Trebian. So one of the other main distinctive features about well, La Britannica, she's a hospital ship, which she's commissioned uh, for, by the Admiralty to be us uh, for the injured individuals. So she will have the hospital green stripe running down her bow, down her hull. This could go either awesome or terrible. Bon! Okay, we have our green stripe, we have our red cross. Uh, do we... How far do we try to take the detailings? Let's add potholes along the bow. Yeah. Okay, we... I think it is time that we do the funnels, and then we are more or less complete, nearly. I, know, I mean, the water textures need doing, and we will do some of our trademark uh, bum clouds, perhaps. Okay. Colors! Beyond magnifique! Okay, we will leave the Britannic cologne for a second. Uh, Passport 2 does wish now he did a white hull instead of a grey hull. But I fear that it's too late to, to do anything about it. Oh, what am I doing? What am I doing? Passport 2! No, 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 no. You're gonna destroy it. Passport 2, you imbecile! The bills are inbound! We were nearly done! Okay, Passport 2, as far as your ideas have gone, that was not a terrible one. Okay, that looks much better, do you not think? I think it does. It just looks. What your mind would rep uh, expect if you were to be looking upon it. Now, once again, it would not be a pass, but to original, authentic, without le bot clouds. It is a pass, but to's way of saying no matter how beautiful life seems, there's always an asshole above you. <laughs> okay, bon, magnifique, we are done. Le Britannic, le Britannic, Shrava, she has uh, grounded up onto the beaches of Kia. The water is swooshing as it's breaking onto the beach. There's a slight ripple as the water really hits the beach. Uh, we, 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 we. I do not think I could do much better than this. Bah, Trebion, Magnifique, let's set it. <laughs> oh, we, 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 we. Okay, so we call this obviously the La, La Britannic. Oh, George, I'm sorry. I'm going to, I'm going to usurp you. Effortless! Oh, get the fuck out of here, George! I wasn't gonna send it to you anywhere, you you individual, you swine, you piece of shit! Get out of my studio! I, I'm not a fan of George anymore, he has turned against me. Oh, here comes High Society himself! Welcome to Passport 2! Glides, maritime artist! All the people I've met said this is fantastic! I need, I need Don on my side, okay? I need to sell it to him. I take his money. Thank you, Don! Welcome to High Society Passport 2. Passport 2 is generating big bucks. Potential investors are taking notice. Okay, we must go faster. Poor! I'm hit once again by inspiration, and she says to me, Kenan the first, Passport 2 must portray Britannic, not as she was poor, but as she was meant to be, an ocean liner extraordinaire. And whilst Passport 2 does 100% agree with your statements, I want to do her hospital colors. <laughs> Sorry. Foundation! Ba, 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 ba. Okay, so it is Southampton, therefore it is a beautiful Mediterranean sunny day. 
Wee 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 wee. For you see, as you sail out of Southampton, as you pass the town, the city of Southampton, as you carry on down the street, you get lovely open countryside on the side. It is a gorgeous side. It is full of trees and banking hills. It is magnific. Bon! Okay! Florida man feeds alligator with Matisse painting. Obviously, he's making way for a new pass part two. Obviously. We're going to set the scene very quickly with the butt clouds. Butt scratcher. Come get your butt scratcher. Butt scratcher. Uh, pass part two is going to add water textures now. But we will draw on top of them and they will fit in and it will be awesome. Bon! Okay, we have a whippily effect of the la solent. Passpartout is enjoying being experimental. Rushing like this. That is the wrong word to use. Pah! Passpartout rushes for no one, but by doing it in, in such a fashion, so haphazardly, I don't know, it is creating quite a, a nice, pleasing aesthetic. Oui! Time to draw the sheep! All of my little trees are gonna get removed. Bon. Oh well, it was fun while I lasted. Oui? Okay, her bow is way too short. This, let's go ahead and extend that, because it is still not too late to extend things. We are still framing the scene. Allow pass me to a second to clean this up. Okay, so Passport 2 has redesigned uh, the butts. Her, her trunk was sagging into the water a little bit. Of, I picked up her trunk and uh, she's looking a bit better. Still a little bit disproportioned, but I think when we start to color her in, that she will make a lot more sense. Bon! Okay, it's time to color in once again. The most favorite part of the entire thing because this is when the skeleton becomes the artistic interpretation. Okay, the hull will be white entirely. And there's always, always a sliver of red anti fouling visible. Okay, okay, we're slowly getting there. So once again, we are going to return the stripe. I will start with a smaller color. Try to hold it steady. And we're going to there. Bon! Bon. Bon. And bon. Wow! And now it's the Red Cross. Passepartout, he wonders to himself why it is how the funnels are so, like, emotive. The color of the funnel really does give off a, a vibe, a kind of a gut emotion, but that's of the ship as a whole. Your bright color, dark color, multiple colors, it, it changes how you believe or how you envision the ship in a way. It is not, it's an interesting thought measure only, okay. Okay, we are uh, almost there. Some final touches and this is ready for sale. Again, I still feel the bow is too short. Or maybe, I don't know, it's lifting a bit too much. I don't know, I do not know. But, you know what? There is far too many limitations in this game for us to be too concerned about that sort of thing. And now for flavor, Passport 2 just adds at random portholes running down just to give a little bit of again detail texture texture and all of the above bon as you see it's complete so here we have everybody Britannic. she is departing Southampton on another astonishing rescue mission of um, giving first aid and medical attention to those who need it most okay once again four picture frames only one thing for sale Don is leaving the shop no 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 uh, HMHS Britannic. Britannic is up for sale. Now, Mademoiselle, you are new to Passport 2. Welcome to my wares. No, no, no. Come back over here. No, no, madam, Do not leave the shop. Oh, damn it. I need the high society on my side. Welcome to Passport 2, Maritime Artist. I have one picture fresh for sale. It has your eye on it. What do you have to say about this? Avant Garde. 5,000? No, 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 no. The last one sold for 7,000. Mary. Mary. You're going to have to do a bit better than this. Oh, no, 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 you get out. No, 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 I'm not taking 5,000. Pwah! That is the garage days. No, 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 the garage. Oh, here comes George. George, you will show Mary what a true passport is worth and value, would you not? Good. 
George, you too also offer five thousands. No! We must talk to the high society if Passport is to get anywhere, okay? The lady in red is coming. She knows a true Passport when she sees it. What do you have to say, mademoiselle? I fancy this. Elizabeth. Three out of three have been 5,000. I feel that is the good that's gonna be. I want Elizabeth to own this. High society will welcome me. Evans Guards, Trespian! Magnifique! Waha! Passepartout's observation with detail has garnered the attention of the city's nobility for now. For now? Pwah! Well, for now, that is an episode I am calling right there. So this has been Passepartout, the starving artist. Beings are going up and up for Passepartout. The nobility are noticing my detailings. It is only a matter of time before we go on to getting our own... I don't know, gallery, I suppose. We have our studio, gallery will be the next evolution. Who knows? Anyway, if you have enjoyed this, leave a comment down below with your thoughts and opinions. And who knows, maybe you will be in the next episode of Passport the Starving Artist. And on the bum shop, thank you for watching. A rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next episode. Goodbye, everybody.